Welcome back, you guys, to Let's Play Life is Strange. And in the last episode, we started a really shitty game, apparently. Whoa! And you. <laughs> oh, I didn't want to move back in time. I gotta run now. It's time to run. Shit, my life. <laughs> life is strange. Or dank. Or both. Strangely dank. Strangely dank. Okay, Max. Retrace every step. I washed my face, I shredded my photo, then the butterfly flew in. They and took, I a, took picture, a picture, and then shit happened. And then the plot got rolling. Leave them out of this bitch. I can tell wow, everybody that, that was fast. You guys got there much faster than last time. Talks to himself. You don't know who the fuck okay, or who you're so we're about to get serious here. Time for what some actual doing? game play. On, right, so where's the thing? Wowzer, it's happening There's something around again. here. Wowzers, it's happening again. I need a hammer to break it open. Okay, it's so we're gonna move this. Would ever even miss your punk ass, would they? Get that gun away from me, psycho! I pick up oh, the holy thing. Shit, I can't let this happen. But if I gotta go back a little bit. I can help her. I'm gonna go back a little further. Now I'm gonna hammer the fire alarm. No what I didn't know the first time I played this was that, uh, the minute you pick up an item, the item's already in your inventory, and whenever you turn around, it doesn't matter what time, how long you did it. It's That's kind of weird. I didn't really get that, like... that. Yeah, that's what I didn't understand, because I was like, why, didn't, why is this not working? Why am I... Why am I flying around here and not able to do what I want to do? And then I realized, oh, the hammer's in my inventory. I can just use it. I don't get how you can have it after you went back and... Uh, I don't know, but that that gets really plot holy later. You hear that fire alarm? Yeah. That means you should be outside. Oh my I gosh, this line. Wait. Girls always use that excuse. Gotta go. Excuse gotta go. For what? For whatever you're up to, your face is covered in guilt. The alarm tripped me out. Then trip on out. <laughs> trip on out of your busy. <laughs> Huh? Why? I mean, it wouldn't Thank be you, just Madsen. bag as an adult saying you better be control. tripping on it's out of here, Missy. Here. <laughs> Leave Miss Caulfield alone and please turn off that alarm since that's your job. Uh, mm, uh, neener, neener, neener. Uh, oh, that alarm is annoying. Anyways. Seriously, nothing worse than a fire alarm at friggin'. Let's get out of here. Nope. You look Speech a little our stressed principal first. Out. Are you okay? I'm, Everyone in this game I'm looks a little stressed out, man. About my a little bit. Future. You're sweating pinballs. Is that all you're thinking about? You could Somehow we're still talking about it while the fire alarm's still going off. Or have you done something off, yeah. wrong? Oh, and yes, he did. Uh, well, Max, talk to me. Uh, hide the truth, because I'm not going to report Nathan this I time, because he's just going to be an point. asshole. Uh. He's always an ass. Yeah, yeah, and that affects you later. And it continues to affect you later, no matter what. This game bases everything on the decisions that you make. All the stuff that happens bases on the decisions that you make. And I'm going to be making decisions based on what I already know and how to get this game a little bit better. happens, you know? There's that teen toot again. Teen toot? Seriously. Tell them what what you know about this game, though. What, who was it written by? Apparently, from what my friend told me, it was written by people in France. And this is how they think. And I guess this is how they think we talk. I don't know if that is one hundred percent true. I may have just flushed my scholarship down the toilet. Yes, I come. But yes, basically, what you can do is I'm gonna do it right now just to prove that I can do it. But uh, what you can do is that after a certain degree, you can um. You can change the outcome of your conversation. And so, for example, if I want to speak to him, I can report Nathan instead. I just saw Nathan Prescott waving a gun around in the girls' room. Nathan Prescott. You sure? Yes. I had a camera. Why didn't I take a picture of him doing it? Hardcore evidence. I saw everything. Seriously. He was babbling like crazy. Okay, slow down. Slow down. So now you saw this without him seeing you. I was hiding behind a stall. I have the right to be there. It's the girls' room. I know, I know. I just want to be completely clear what happened. Mr. Prescott happens to be from the town's most distinguished family and one of Blackwell's most honored students. So it's hard for me to see him brandishing a weapon in the girls' bathroom. So what happened next? Then... then he left. I ran out here wondering what to do. Are you going to bust him? This is a serious charge. I'll look into the matter personally. 
Thank you for bringing it to my attention. That's it? After what I told we'll you? We'll continue this discussion later in my office. Ugh. Please go outside with the rest of your class now, Ms. Caulfield. Basically my issue with this game. Of course this academic drone won't do anything since the press... So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go back and I'm going to do what I did before. I because I like that answer better and it's not really... The problem with this is that... No matter what it is you pick, it's not she, right. Yeah, she's going to bitch at you out about that choice. So I'm going to hide the truth anyways, and I'm just going to do my thing. Just got sick and cl yes, and I'm going to go outside uh, and just deal with it. I don't care. So literally, what she says back and forth literally bothers me. Like, you can rewind like three times like that, and she's like, oh, maybe I should rewind and change my because answer. They want, like, because I they think the you're- I get that it like does it, but literally for the set, like the first time I get it, but you're doing it again? And no matter what the choice is, it's wrong. Like- but no, and like they say, every choice you make has consequences, and that's fine. But it is an issue. So there are more missing persons posters. Missing persons posters. Rachel and is she person posters? She looks so oh, hopeful. Oh, anyways, and pretty. so I there's a lady. Hello, her. lady. Hi, Ms. Grant. Excuse me, Max. I know everybody loves being asked to sign a petition, but would you do Miss Grant a favor and hear me out? Sure. Oh, <laughs> I chose the wrong answer. Yeah, nice work. I don't really have the time. I can go back in time and do that again, though. Serious things are taking place at Blackwell. And I can do it again. Most of all, come back and see me when you do have time. Promise. Fuck it. I'm going back. I'll sign that petition. Hi, Miss Grant. Sorry. Excuse me, Max. I knew what I meant to do, and I chose the wrong answer anyway. Sure, I always have time for you. What are you gonna do when you can't rewind anymore and you pick the wrong answer? It's just gonna have to happen the way it happens! Halls, classrooms, gym, dorm rooms, etc. Liquor is tasting pretty damn good right now. Not a high security penitentiary. That's crazy. I get why school should be on high alert these days, but cameras in the dorm rooms. It's a slippery slope. And it's up to you and your classmates to stand up here. Blackwell Academy has a noble heritage. A noble from heritage. Native Americans, from Native Americans who founded this land. Pioneers okay. Pioneers who Not shared the peace. Violence. Of course. Is Blackwell the Native American? <laughs> I'm like, every time you say it out loud, I'm choosing a different choice. Uh. <laughs> so don't say anything out loud unless you want your choices made wrong. It doesn't matter, honestly. I, you can change this conversation up if you turn back in time, but I'm choosing not to. You get more information choosing the right choices, though. Of course I'll sign. Absolutely. I don't mind security, but not pure surveillance. I knew you were my favorite new student at Blackwell for a good reason. Favoritism! I am loved. See, and that'll have a consequence later. Oh, then I got, a, I got a message. Hey, Max, give me my flash drive. I need some info in space. Hello. I'll meet you in the lot. Looking cool. You'll see. My camera will soon be ready. Okay, cool. Yeah, you can answer text me Well, question. I don't answer the text messages, but you get texts throughout the day. So, and I can press this to open the journal, and... October is my favorite month, the best weather of the year. I love watching the leaves change color, turning into tiny flames. But it's still too damn hot, thanks, global warming. Really, game. Anyway, <laughs> and I can't bust out the big coats and sweaters or scary movies yet. Soon, Kate will let me borrow the October Country by Ray Bradbury. I'm literally a little far away, guys. If I say something wrong, my bad. Where is this even located at? No idea. I ha Oh, I think it's like Oregon or something. Oh. I haven't read much about him, which caused Warren to almost revoke my geek card before I held up my coffee. Cred. Not geek card. Geek Sorry. cred. <laughs> Sorry. Like I said, I'm far away, so it's hard. I can't read. There you go. I have to do this. Where am I kind of the battle, a battle royale? But he nails the autumn atmosphere in small towns. The last time I wore a Halloween costume was with Chloe. I have pictures in one of my old albums. I should find a real Halloween party to crash so I can experience some social mingling. It's that or, or a Vortex Club stoke, stroke fest or sto yeah, stroke, stroke fest. fest or swimming party. Or is that back stroke fest? You're so punny, Max. <laughs> uh. <laughs> Why would you write that? Because this is her personal journal, dude. I'm pretty sure she's not expecting anybody else to read it but us. <laughs> At least I'm trying to climb out of my cocoon. I shouldn't expect my life to completely change after a few weeks at Blackwell County. As my parents love telling 
Me on the loo. You have all the time in the world. Objective, I need to get my room. Go to my room and get one slash. Yeah, so we gotta go to the We actually go further back where she's like, I'm going to Blackwell. Sick. Gets to Blackwell. Blackwell fucking sucks. Mm -hmm. Not as sick. But we're not gonna read all of the journal entries unless something really funny comes up and I just... Oh, there was a invisible wall. Um, and if there's nothing that comes up that's interesting, we're not gonna do it. Anyway. I want to talk to the creepy guy. About the maintenance dude? Yup. He talks not in third he, person. He's a nice guy. He is a nice guy, but you just said he was creepy. He is. He looks like a creeper. I need to go to my room and return Warren's flash oh, drive. What's this? A look? I always get a little giddy when I think about having my own room here. I would be too, to be honest. Yeah, I mean, at first when I played, when I actually watched this, I was not sure if this was like a, what's it called? Like a Hold high on. school or a, uh college because i was like and i was like oh boarding school probably oh hi max how are you doing fantastic i'm by myself for eating chiclet pretty soon i'll be bonding with victoria at the Dude. vortex club i think you're better off reading chiclet good point now if you'll excuse me i swear to god something happens it's a little like, bit later i think yeah i think so too I want to go inside. Oh look, it's Max Caulfield. Wait, the selfie hoe of Blackwell. Selfie hoe. <laughs> selfie hoe. Wait, no, this is another good line. Just coming. because you're this taller. Is a, this is another Mr. good line coming up here. Wave hipster bullshit. Wave hipster. No, bullshit. that's not it. Bulgarian processor. You could barely even say that. I guess you got your meds filled. <laughs> Since you know all the answers, I guess you have to find another way into the dorm. We ain't moving. Oh, and I will. Oh. Wait. Oh, wait. Hold that pose. So original. Don't worry, Max. I'll put a vintage filter on it right before I post it all over social medias. Now, why don't you go fuck yourself? There either? it is. <laughs> yes, Victoria. Okay. okay. I don't even get it. So you took a picture of me doing this. Holding my arm and looking down. I Samuel Da Vinci to paint the window. Ah! So now I'm, I'm the embarrassment on all the social medias. So now I gotta find a way into the dorm. And we're gonna watch this guy for just a minute. Just a minute. Watch him do his thing. Hold it. Walk up the ladder with his can of paint. Yep. Seriously, I don't get it. It's like, I did this. And you took a picture of me holding my arm. How are you socially humiliating me throughout the uh, social media's world? I seriously don't get people. I don't either. Anyway, kind of paint them, I guess, uh, window ledges. Do you understand English? Get lost. No hablo English. So no. So I'm thinking sprinkler. I could crank the sprinkler up and give Victoria and her clones incentive to beat it. So what are we gonna do? Turn we're gonna, the sprinkler we're up. We're gonna go here and turn the sprinkler up. This main sprinkler valve looks easy enough to use. But how do we use it? That's the question. Shouldn't we go back in time? Yeah. And wait for the sprinklers to actually turn on? Yeah. Actually, first, before we even do that, I think we have to... Well, we're going to use it first and see what else we have to do. Yeah. What the hell? Are you kidding? Look at this. Chill I got wet. Water. Oh, my yeah. gosh. Water on my cashmere? <laughs> you know oh. This fucking outfit costs? You look great. I can't even chill on the steps. So that wasn't good enough. So what are we going to do? We're going to go back in time just a little bit further. Because we can't even chill on the steps, apparently. The problem of high school children today, I guess. Okay, but anyways, so we're going to do something with the paint bucket. I'm going to tamper with it a little bit. Okay, let's see if this works. Sweet. And now we're going to go turn on the water pump. What the hell? Are you kidding? Look at this. Chill, it's cashmere. Water. It's cashmere. Water on my cashmere. Do you know how much this fucking outfit costs? Why do you 
Great. I can't even chill on the steps. And it gets better. Can't even chill on the steps. Because mm -hmm. in Kashmir. No way! No fucking you okay, way! Victoria? Oh, Sam, you were sorry. Wet, wet paint is not good for hair, nope. Sorry. Get the hell away from me, weirdo. Then, uh... Hold on, <laughs> hold on, we'll get some towels, we'll be right back. So move your ass before I dry. It worked. Don't mess with Max, bitches. Now we have an opportunity to do something that's gonna change our time. We can go up and talk to her. Speak to her. Uh, we can either be a complete bitch or be nice about nice? it. Oh, oh yeah. I'm gonna comfort her. I'm gonna be nice, because that's just I'm who I am. Sorry. That's an awesome cashmere coat. Despite I'm the one that ruined it. It was. But there'll be another. Well, you always seem to know how to pick the right outfits. I do have some talent. Mr. Jefferson told me. I've seen your picture. Oh, Mr. Jefferson! Richard Avedon-esque. He's one of my heroes. Thanks, Max. I'm gonna I hate you later in a few a minutes, but sign on me. thanks for being so <laughs> nice to me right now. <laughs> Literally, uh, I think that's like it would really just bother me because I knew people shots. like that. I knew someone Sorry just like that. Blocking you and when I was in school. And the go fuck yourself. -y. Everybody, you have to either be the queen bitch or you have to funny. bow down to the queen bitch. There is no in between in in, in college or whatever. High school, high school, college, whatever. Nah, college. There's right, not well. really any. So like I was nice enough. I was nice to her, so she's gonna actually let me inside the door. Victoria probably played. And she's like, maybe I should have played her. No. It's like it's gonna be nice. It's gonna be nice for later. I'd rather be a nice person and stuff later. So, room two. Red room. No way in hell am I ever going in here. Look at pictures. I'd love to make a photo collage. Young guns training. Posted these. To operate firearms. Cool. Yeah, people here are merciless. Safe, not sorry. See Kate's video for proof. Is going to be pissed we took so long. Stomp him, Bigfoot. still a cheerleader at heart. Why is there toilet paper in the hallway? Because that's just the way. Oh, Victoria, give me a fucking break. <laughs> How sad. I didn't write anything. I have nothing to say. Home Anyways. sweet home. My favorite cocoon. Hmm. Let's look at her wall. The Max Caulfield Photo Memorial Wall. I can lie down. That's what I do after class sometimes. When I went to after class, just lies in bed and then just doesn't get up. <sighs> it feels so nice to just relax. This day has been so damn bizarre, and it feels like it has gone on forever. Maybe I'll just wake up now and find out I was dreaming all of this. Or like Poe said, a dream within a dream. Okay, it's time to get up. I'm not listening to any more mon inner mo <laughs> mo monologuing. Uh, I got a message from Mom. Hi, honey. A person sent me you saying that he's concerned about your attitude and behavior and you're not fitting while hiding in your dorm. You mean like what every high school kid does? But they're a change world with your camera. Please talk to me soon. We miss you. Thanks, Mom. Looks like Dana left me a little. Hey, girl, I borrowed your drive so I can watch some films while I study. If you need a badge, just talk to my room. X O D. Okay. Great. Now I have to go read the photo album from Dana's room. Philip Lorca de Corsha, my man. I don't think I could take my camera to those places. Look at that shot. I love Julia Cameron's Victorian vibe. Talk about analog cameras. Ah, oh, Dolly, what a fantastic eye. He could truly freeze time. I could water the plant. <laughs> you are thirsty. I'm the worst baby mama. Wow. <laughs> I'm the worst baby mama. I'm the worst baby mama. <laughs> It's a friggin' plant! It had actual <laughs> consequences. Cool. I saved, my, I saved my fucking plant. Watering your plant will have consequences. I'm glad Kate let me borrow her copy of The October Country. 
I should have everything. I can play guitar too, but I'm not in the mood. Cookies. Ooh, cookies. I love looks that out. mom sent me a fat box of chocolate coconut bites for my birthday. And slipped in a $200 gift certificate. She sure knows how to make a sad That's birthday. That's the best mom ever. So tell me the truth or rotten. Oh boy. Teenage issues. Welcome to Joy. the real drama queens of Blackwell. Hmm. What's up? Hey, Juliet. Is everything cool? Oh yes, Max. I've locked Dana in the room because we're cool. What? You don't have people in your room when what, you're cool? What did she do? Cool? I do what it all the time. What did she do? Dana's been sexting with my boyfriend. Ouch. How did you find out? Uh, why do you care? Why are you even asking me? You never talk. Just zone out with your camera. That's why I'm talking to you now. What's my last name? I don't know this. So I remember what it is. What is it? X. Juliet Watson. Duh. I'm flattered. I didn't even think I don't you even knew remember my name that. I don't ever think I got that right in the first of place. Of course I do. Just because I don't talk a lot doesn't mean I don't care. So, how did you find out about them? According to Victoria, Dana would do anything to date a quarterback. According to Victoria? Um. Yeah. Hmm. She saw the sext, and Zachary won't answer his phone. Once Dana admits it, she can go. Straight to hell. Oh. <sighs> so what do we gotta do to make her happy? We gotta go sneak into other people's rooms and steal stuff. Seriously. That's nice of you. Apparently, in this world, you can just enter to any- nobody locks their doors. I don't have to look at everything. I'll give Victoria props for not posting my photo. And for this nice shot. Boom. This is the email I need to show Juliet. Seriously. Now I have to print this fast. I guess everyone's very trusting in this world that they leave all their electronics on and they, uh, also get their doors unlocked. Indeed. It's amazing that her printer is all the way on the other side of the room, too. Oh, wireless this printing. Convince Juliet that Dana is innocent. My printer was like that when I was in college, so nice. Until it broke. That sucked a lot since I had a thing, huge paper to oh. print out still. Mm -hmm. Juliet, read this. Of course. I'm an asshole. I'm sorry, Dana. You are. And I hope so. You really think I'd mess around with Zachary? No. But I get stupid jealous. I owe you dinner. Still love me? And you do my laundry. Thanks, Max. You're like the Blackwell Ninja. The Blackwell Ninja. Let's see what Zach has to say about <laughs> Victoria. You set me free. Thank you. Warren's flash drive is on my desk. Lovely. Anyway, anyways, oh let's God. go in here and chat with her. Get shall the flash we? drive, and then I'll go see Warren. Seriously, thanks again. I can't believe Juliet locked me in my own room. Real mature. Victoria is not nice. I don't get it. She has everything, and to pull that prank on a friend. Just because they're in the Vortex Club doesn't mean they're BFFs. I'm in it, and Victoria. That's not very nice. Now. Max, you're smart to be a loner here. Though Warren obviously likes hanging with you. He's a good guy. He's yes, a good he guy. Is. A geek like me. You saw the files in his flash drive. Tons of crazy shit. Films I've never even heard of. And in a special folder called Max. Yeah, okay. I gotcha. Creepy, Are you blushing? A <laughs> little bit. I mean, Go ahead and grab the flash drive. I know right. I have my special folder that has like a that's it, that has my favorite guy in it, but I don't keep it on my you flash drive for everyone to see. So Max never has to chase it down again. Anyways, let's get out of here. I'm tired of doing this. Yeah, let's go return this flash drive to our not creepy friend. Yes. I love the parking lot. I can count all the cars. <laughs> game is just 
weird beyond all recognition. Yeah. Well, you know what they say. Life is strange. Oi. Okay, I think this is... Shit. Yep, right there. Ow in the head. I'm hurt. Damn, I better rewind. Alyssa, move your head. If you insist, Max. Now that's what I'm talking about. I actually helped somebody. This actual have consequences. No, wait. <laughs> By the way, thanks, but we're not friends. Okay, bitch. Whatever. I don't really want to be your friend anyway. Why can't we be friends? Why can't <laughs> we be friends? Exactly. So don't think I'm blind. I see everything here at Blackwell. Do you I don't think you're. I believe saying? I was the black one ninja, not you. Pretty much. <laughs> I don't know. Take I'm gonna step. intervene. I don't care. But technically, isn't Why don't you this one of the photos you can Excuse take for us. the? This is official campus business. Excuse What's me. It called? You shouldn't be yelling at students or bullying. Them. Hey, hey. Uh, nobody you know, is you're bullying anybody. Photos and trophy thing. No, you're not. Or not. You're part of the problem, Missy. I will remember this conversation. I actually not sure about it. Oh, Max, that was great. I think you scared him for once. I, I have to go, but thank you. It means a lot. Anytime, Kate. I'm a good friend. I felt like an everyday hero. But now, uh, now, I, now, I don't care if David the dickhead is after me. But I was gonna say, isn't the photo you take of him and Kate like the one you can? That's like a trophy thing or not? Yes, but I'm not. I would rather be a good friend, and you know, mm. I'm a good friend. But you're technically taking it as like evidence that he was being a douche. Not so much of getting all the photos, guys. It's okay, I'm not really going to get all the photos. Yeah, okay. we can try to get all the other ones. Anyways, friend person is over there. Let's go talk to friend person. There's graffiti. I wonder how long before Samuel has to repaint that. Tarn heaven? Tarn man? I can't read that. Uh, whoever wrote it was just a tard, I guess. <laughs> I guess. Hello, friend. What up, Max? How are you? Here's your flash. Thanks. Nice. Friend zone. I think you Check mean retro zone. Pretty much. Hey, very old school. I can't Thank wait for the ending of this game when I get to show you what I wanted to show you. There's one in Newburgh, just sixty miles away. You're in the wrong time, Warren. But then so am I. You okay? It's been one strange fucking day. Life is strange like after all. I heard Victoria got a face full of paint. <laughs> I'd pay money to see a photo of that. Really? I wish I would have known. You probably could have raised a Kickstarter fund just for that one image of her covered in paint. Had I known that. Anyway, Victoria took down my photo, so that drama ended well. So, did you get a chance to check out the movie booty on my flash drive? Movie booty? <laughs> wow. I couldn't yeah, find nice. lots of different movies. You had some cool shit on there. From Akira to Twilight Zone? Akira. The movie that boy. actually is supposed to... That was really expensive to make, but pirate. doesn't look like it. <laughs> exactly. It does sound better I've than actually... Two. Okay, just say, I've actually uh -huh. never seen Akira before, but I've seen shots Cannibal of it from Holocaust. A.B. Helen, honestly. Oh, Cannibal Holocaust. Mm. I've seen it. I was more disturbed by all those emo vampire movies in there. <laughs> Can a sensitive high school boy love sensitive vampires too? No. So no. Sensitive. Ouch, that sounds awful the way you say it. No, I was impressed you had faster pussycat kill kill. Uh. Russ Mayer was a genius of black and white. Plus, babes with breasts. Who would beat your sensitive ass down? If I was lucky. Speaking of hip and fast, we should cruise out in my car to an actual movie this week. But you seem distracted. I don't want to talk about it. It was a long day. I don't want to speak about it. This is kind of a crazy day for me. I mean, I literally think I'm going crazy. I may be a pest, but I'm a good listener. Please, for just reals, let me. This is me touch your butt. Me, I just want to touch your butt. Media. Don't insult me. Max, go on. I had this incredibly bizarro experience in Mr. Jefferson's class today. I mean, life-changing. 
Have you ever had a dream so real it was like a movie? Max Caulfield, right? Uh oh. You're one of the Jefferson's photo groupies? Maybe. I'm one of his students. What the fuck ever? I know you like to take pictures, especially when you're hiding out in the bathrooms. You yeah. Just tell me what Butterfly's you saw. Butterfly's flying there. Now. I wasn't in there. Answer me, What are you bitch. talking about? I know you're new here, but don't even play stupid with me. I'm not new. I've lived here for years. Then you should know the Prescotts own this shithole. Uh, but, but I didn't say anything to the teacher. Yeah. I didn't say anything but to the principal. he knows you were there somehow. Somehow? I guess it's your photo. He recognizes the back of your head. Take a step back, Nathan Prescott. Oh, man. You're telling me what to do? Get away from her, dude. I went ahead. Hey, leave him alone. Honestly, doesn't Nobody that hurt when you headbutt somebody? No, yes. Parents, I mean, I'd be like, headbutt is like, oh, why did I do that? Yes. Max? Chloe? No Wait, way. I recognize you now just but I did it in the bathroom? Oh, she couldn't see him her before. Get in, Max! I I thought she got a good look at her, she ran out and went, no. I thought she got looked at her. Nobody! Nobody! <laughs> and David just runs in on the scene. He's like, what you guys doing? Man, Nathan Prescott is messed up and dangerous. This day never ends. Oh, and thanks, Chloe. I was after five years or still. Getting to that. <laughs> exactly. Maybe. I don't know. Don't give me the guilty face. At least pretend you're glad to see me. I am seriously glad to see you. Oh, and thanks, Chloe. It makes perfect sense I'd see you today. Yes, it's been that kind of day. So what did that freak want with you? Hopefully nothing. I got Hopefully nothing, nothing after <laughs> today. My drink so matches her hair. I know, right? Just okay, just to say this, uh, I don't hate Chloe, but I don't like yeah, her either. I owe her big time. She's an okay character. She just really kind of my. She just really gets on my nerves a lot. Feels so weird to be. But it's not enough that I would say I hate her. So Seattle suck hard. I guess. It was cool. Indeed. The only problem with Seattle is that it rains a lot. Out of my league. I would think you'd fit right in with the art school hipsters. Right. You look like the cover of hipstergirl.com. At least you're still a smartass. That's why I'm here. Please, girl. You came back for Blackwell Academy. Holy for Mr. Jefferson. No. All photography programs in the country. Mr. Jefferson. And my favorite teacher, Mark Jefferson. Since she so came back to Arcadia for a teacher, not your best friend. Don't you think I'm happy to see you? No. You were happy to wait five years without a call or even a text. I wanted to. I'm sorry. I wanted to. I was just so tripped out over leaving our kids. Maybe we should have been tripping on Hopefully, out leaving a text. Phone and Seriously. For time. They were BFFs. You've been at Blackwell for almost a month without letting me know. Enough said. I just wanted to settle in first and not be such a shy, cliche geek. I guess. Totally <laughs> but you don't have sad excuses on Mr. What? Jackson. Don't use that. Yeah, I wouldn't count you as shy or cliche. Dude, I'm pretty shy when it comes down to it. I, just because I can actually talk to people don't mean crap. Uh. Doesn't mean any- I'm Wait! I, next! Go to the lines! Coming up soon! Yeah, here it is. Broken. Man, are you cereal? Ugh! Oh, are you cereal? Not everything changes. Except my camera has officially taken a shit. My step douche has a boatload of tools. Maybe oh, that's a drink. Step douche. <laughs> step douche. Bird alert. My stepdad has a fully stock garage. And he actually is a tiny tool. Welcome home, Max. Come on in, don't be shy. The house still looks nice. Home, shit, home. Chloe's very stereotypical punk chick. Yeah. 
I still like her though. I can identify a little bit with her at least. The blue hair, not excluded. All the boobs on the wall? Because you totally have all them boobs on your wall. I have a body pillow, something like that. <laughs> yeah, except Sora doesn't have boobs. Yeah, if I got a girl My one, I'd be like that. The last time you saw it. If you could get a girl body pillow, then cool. who would you get on it? This isn't exactly my choice. I don't know. I, I considered Mitsuru from, uh. No, Mikuru from, uh. Put on some music while Haruhi I. Suzumiya. So we can look around the room. Eh. She's got herself a big old American flag. Some fan. Yeah. Let's, look, let's actually turn on the boom. We can turn on it the boom box, I think. Oh, we won't play without any power. Guess we can't. Too bad I can't stream any music from. She looks super happy. She looks super sad. She looks super she happy. Looks super she looks super stoned. <laughs> Back, you can stop saying super. But anyways, actually, for now, I'm gonna think I'm gonna cut the episode off here. Super I hope you guys are having. <laughs> hope you guys are having a fantastic day. Please like, comment, subscribe for more. I do videos like this every other day. I'll talk to you guys later. Right? Bye bye.